We were under 24-hour police protection, which began on Sunday morning, November 24, uh, after an anonymous tip or call had come through the City Hall switchboard. I understand that a similar call had been picked up at one of the FBI offices out of the state, and that brought them into the picture also. Uh, we were under their protection, uh, starting with four men on each shift, three shifts a day, and that gradually was reduced to uh, two men on each shift. And then the worst thing, I think, that naturally shook her up worse than any other mm -hmm. was when on New Year's Eve night, uh, she picked up the phone in the bedroom and a very well-modulated, mature voice, apparently sober, uh, do you want to give the quotation on that? No, you give the quotation. Well, I'll, uh, I'll omit some of the words when he said, this is the night a good night to get that blankety-blank mayor, and we're going to do it now. A very unusual circumstance occurred immediately following that phone call, because when Ms. Cabell notified one of the officers on duty, uh, he immediately reported to his captain. And then as he started back in the living room where I and our uh, guests were, the lights went out in the front part of the house, and you can imagine what his thoughts were. And though in my ignorance of what was going on, but realizing that a fuse had blown, I grabbed up a flashlight and ran out to the garage, and with both detectives in hot pursuit and shielding me from the open garage door that opened out onto the street. But there were no further incidents uh, uh, to cause any trouble. Uh, I was not advised of this call, but immediately sensed, due to the tightening of security, that something had happened. And then I was quite careful not to uh, worry Ms. Cabell, and she was careful not to worry me by telling me about it, so we played cat and mouse all the rest of the evening. Did they ever find out who made the calls? We never did. It was not uh, traceable. It was recorded, but we couldn't trace it. Uh, with reference to the recent news story uh, concerning your seeing the gun that was poked out the window of the school book depository. You did see it, of course, as we rounded the corner, did you not? This uh, sighting of the actual gun, of course, was reported to proper authorities, and no further mention was made of it. But it just now has leaked out uh, through our very aggressive press, and so there's no use in uh, trying to uh, cover it up anymore. Uh